get started. First, go to start, uh, start, or wherever you saved it after it's done installing. It'll only take a minimum of like 30 seconds or less. Uh, even on slow computers, I, but I don't guarantee that. Mine's pretty slow, but, alright. Open it, and this message will pop up. The copy of Hypercam is not registered. Every AVI that you capture with it will have a small and registered Hypercam sign in the corner. Um, that doesn't really matter. Because you can barely see it. You'll see it in the video when I put it on YouTube. Alright, just push OK. And when. Alright, now select where you're recording. Just like, uh, you can select region. Select wherever you want to record. Um, or click select window, and it'll have only a certain area of linking. Or it'll have like, the buttons down here linking. Oh, yeah, this is just my pixels are messed up on the screen. Um, okay, so, so I'll do select region, make a little box. These icons are right there. Now, start recording by push start record, which is right there, and, or you can use hotkeys, I have it F2 start slash stop recording, and the pause is F3, um, so just start recording, and it will show we have record. I didn't pre-plan I didn't pre-plan any of this, so sorry if anything sorry for me talking so slow. I'm trying to think at the same time. Okay, so you play it after you're done, or normally it'll save it in my documents. It'll show all the videos. Uh, right now I have the record cursor off. That way you'll record your mouse and you play the video. Okay, so what you can do right now is hotkeys. And the capture area where the mouse is moved and the calling keys are pressed. Uh, I just have it on control right now. What this is, is... Watch. Let me put my camera in. Okay, so when you're done recording, just save it. Push play once again. Um, or go to my documents. It'll be in, your, in the documents. No, no, my video or anything. You can change how many frames per second you want. Both of these will change at the same time. You can make it one, two. These will just record slower. I leave it at 10, and because it basically records real time, so. Okay, so you can also record sound. It doesn't record the sound on your computer, so if you wanted to record a video, you couldn't really do that. Um, it records from your microphone, which is on my webcam. Um, the only flaw is when you're recording a video, have record sound on. The video is usually faster than the sound, so it'll show the video than the sound. Uh, unless it's just my computer. But I just don't use that at all, because I really don't have any need for it. Uh, that's basically it. So, thanks for watching.